Jim Holly, Supercross Live on supercrossonline.com. Well, welcome to this week's Toyota Tailgate Talk. Each and every week, I kind of go behind the scenes. This week, I'm behind the scenes with Mr. Uh, Ted Parks. Uh, Ted, you help out a lot of privateers. I mean, there's 14, 15 guys you help out. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. We try to help them live a dream and get to the next level to the uh, factory teams. I mean, some of these guys, you know, they're making the main events. Your son, Teddy, he's yeah. also in here. I, yeah. I saw Weston Pike's bike. I saw uh, Mr. Sipes's, Justin Sipes's bike in here. I mean, a lot of guys. I mean, you not only have three-digit guys, but two-digit guys. You've been doing this for about five years, actually 14 years with amateurs, but professionally five years. Uh, how does someone go about, uh, you know, contacting you, and how does it work? Well, you go online, it's uh, theprivateerjourney.com. You can review what we're about, download an app to uh, sign up for the outdoors. We're doing the outdoor season. We'll do 10 riders and close the door this season. Next season, we're gonna step it up to 20 riders. And you had mentioned next year, uh, possibly a semi. Now you're doing it out of a motorhome and a big trailer and everything, but you're getting, you're busting it out at the seams. You need a big right. semi. Correct, correct. We're gonna step up because I like my stuff, you know, neat, professional, and we don't stack stuff on top of each other, so we need a little more room. So we're gonna step up and take a 200 foot aisle next year. Any of the guys, uh, any rivalries in here? I mean, I know a lot of your guys are in that last chance race. Only oh, yeah. they only oh, take yeah. a couple, and you know, when push comes to shove, I mean, you had any incidents like that where the guys come back and you gotta kind of get in between? Hey, guys, don't worry, there's another race. Well, we had Jimmy Iverson. He was on with me for three weeks, and P.J. Larson, and and then you know we got Weston Pike and Justin Sipes, and then Teddy and Adam, and I mean they're all right on the bubble. You know, most of the couple of the guys are two digits, they're in, and then, you know, my three digit guys, they're getting to that top 20, and that's what we're about. And then, you know, I lost uh, PJ, moved up to another team, and Iverson. But, but you had to help him get up there. I mean, that's yep. what I'm saying. You yep. helped PJ Larson, and, yep. and in turn, he, he, he moved on to, uh, you know, a, a good ride. Correct, correct. That's what we're about. And, you know, it's it's sad for me sometimes, but that's what I'm about. I'm, I'm to help them get to that next level and then help the next privateer come into the program and help him to get over to, to the factory teams. And it makes it a little bit easier. I mean, they don't have to worry about, you know, you take their bike and everything. All they have to do is basically show up. And what about spare parts? Do the guys have their own spare parts? I, I noticed in the trailer you had some lockers and stuff. They each got their lockers? Yes, sir. They had lockers. I. I you know, my team, they don't have to run our products, but I have sponsor stuff like, you know, Vertec and Engine Ice and Hot Cams and Pivot Works and PMP and, you know, on and on. I've got a lot of sponsors that give these riders free product on my team, and this is where I help them try to save some money. And then, of course, we feed them lunch and dinner. All this is part of the program to help them save money so they can get to the races, to help the sport grow. And we try to help the industry, and we pass out discounts and coupons to all the fans and the local amateur tracks to promote these guys through the dealerships. So everybody, you know, reaps from their rewards. It All helps right. everybody. We heard it from uh, Teddy Parks. Uh, he's a saint in Supercross. He helps out a lot of privateers. Well, that's it for this week's Toyota Tailgate Talk. Make sure you check us out Wednesday nights on supercrossonline.com, 5 p.m. on that uh, East Coast time. And don't forget about Thursday nights after the checkered flag with Ralph, Ricky, and Jeff. <laughs>